another video of quirky crafts and collectibles. Today Pandora is celebrating her alter ego's birthday. Panda's birthday was on the 6th of August. Now let's welcome the host of the show, Pandora Box herself. Oh chickers and welcome mini me Pandora Box and yes we're celebrating Panda's birthday on the 6th of August and let's see what Panda got for his birthday. Well as you can see Panda got the Rainbow High Swim playset. So this is the actual box of the Rainbow High pool set. And as you can see, a lot of accessories. And let's have a closer look. So as you can see right now, Barbie and Ken are using the swimsuit. I've got the umbrella, so it comes with the umbrella. It moves back and forth like that. And you can take it off from there, place it in different areas. So it pops here like that. And you can pop it somewhere else if you like. It can even stand on its own. As you can see, if you want it next to the swim area or next to Barbie. That gives you more room on this side. All right, and then you get palm trees. And if you haven't known, or you didn't know, this button here, changes the colour of the swimming pool. So when you've got water in it, you can actually see it at the moment it's red and it's yellow. Oh, that's yellow. Green. Blue. This blue is very nice. Back to a pink or purple. Actually like I thought they actually changed colour. I actually like the blue, it gives it more of a, a nice effect. You get the decking, of course, and it's got some stairs. Have a look at the stairs. And on this side, we have two deck chairs. We have a bar, Barbie there got stairs going there and we get two drink bottles or two drink and there you go I think it's just absolutely gorgeous I have been wanting this for so long so Christopher my husband bought this for my alter ego <laughs> um, that's for my birthday because my birthday is Pandora Boxes on the 22nd of April, where my alter ego is on the 6th of August. Okay, but that's not all I got. I got more. So I haven't unboxed this present yet, but I'm gonna show you what it is. Ta-da! I also got the dream house for my birthday as well. And I will be putting that up and hopefully using this as a backdrop when I'm filming. It is quite large and I cannot wait to put this up. It has 75 pieces. That's the size. New. And there's the flooring is all covered where the old one wasn't. Got a swimming pool, but we don't need a swimming pool. It has lights and functions, sounds. So eventually I'll be putting that up and hopefully having it up on my desk. 
I've also have more unboxing to do, lots of unboxing. And I'm so sorry that I haven't been in the picture for so long. Um, I've just had a lot of things happening and I don't know if you can hear my voice. It's a little bit um, on the croaky side, so I haven't been well, but I'm getting there, I'm getting there. And also um, I've had functions, I've had musicals, I've had um, doll shows and quilt shows and I'll give you a little look on what the whole week has been and why I haven't been able to catch up with uh, some of my videos. So with this video let me show you what we've been up to. So we start at Friday afternoon at one o'clock and we set our quilter's little helper at the annual Camden quilt show. This is what it looks like. So Chris would do this Saturday and with the help with our very good friend Michelle and on the same day I raced down to vocalize the Broadway review, join the team for the first show that the kids put on, the on Broadway review and they did an amazing, amazing production. These were the costumes I put together and made and I think it's just absolutely fantastic. Then Saturday morning at 5 a.m., Katie, Cindy and I got up and we set up the markets. So while Chris was at the quilt show, I was doing the markets. This is what it looks like. So I had my dolls and my miniatures and the girls bought some of their things and I thought they can sell some of their things as well. And this is what it all looks like. So after that, we finished at one after packing. I then go back to the studio for the second production of the Broadway Review. And here are some of the posters. Now that's me, but I was not in the show. <laughs> so that was Saturday night. I got to go home by about 10 p.m. and I was ready for the next adventure. The 6th, on my birthday, I was at the annual quilt show with Chris and we got to display our very first quilts. So this one's mine and um, Chris had his up as well. So we we're very proud to have our quilts up on the show as well. Now I hope you enjoyed this episode of Quirky Crafts and Collectibles. So make sure you like the show, subscribe so you don't miss any future episodes and comment and let us know if you have this set or others or the dream house until next time a mini me pandora box <laughs>